We had an amazing summer. New friends were found along with the gold that drew us all close. Yet, just as quickly as summer came, it ended just the same. Fall was soon upon us, and the low water and dry weather helped us find some of our best gold to date. Before we could blink, winter was here, with freezing cold and rain and snow. None of these things kept us from getting to the gold. Yet. JC and Todd are up here. I'm about to go back up there um, because I was digging around right here and not getting very good gold and I did some sampling up by them and got really good gold. About to clean up the sluice and go bring it down there and set up. Because I have an early day today. I gotta get home a little earlier. Check out the sluice though, it looks good. I was listening to bird, I'm like, what the heck is that bird's problem? There's nothing around. Yeah, you yeah. know, that bird was probably signaling yep. all the other birds that in the oh, yeah. yeah. Let's see that picture again. That, that, was, <laughs> that was pretty cool. I That's wish I had seen it. This, this is uh, the second time there's been a bear around me and people have seen it, I have it. <laughs> Look at that picker. Come down there. When that dries out, you should vacuum. What yeah. I can't get out, you should try it. Pretty cool. If it dries out today. I don't <laughs> think we're gonna get much sun over there. Uh, picture or not? Oh, he just man. pulled it out. He's like, oh, it's getting bigger. He just kept getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> All <laughs> right. Piece, man. Yeah. This sluice box is sick. There's yep. the other piece right there. Yep. Mm -hmm. Sweet. <laughs> nice. That looks good. Yeah, try to drain the swamp. <laughs> drain the swamp. I'm draining the swamp, <laughs> baby. Right there. <laughs> Make gold great again. Yeah, where the uh, plant's <laughs> growing is where I want to go. <laughs> oh, yeah, he's got the idea. He's going to get the good gold up there. <laughs> Let's check out the box before I do a cleanup. Todd just got. Nice. Nice. It's a poker picker. <laughs> poker picker. You can pick it up, but it's a clinker. <coughs> yep. 
I gotta get out of here. I gotta leave these guys. There's a bear somewhere over there. <laughs> yeah, it's that way at least. Yeah. Probably waiting right on the He's waiting. He's like licking his chops right now. Yeah, Tasty there, treat. Man. Yeah. <laughs> so, you guys hear me screaming, you know what's up. <laughs> All right, getting out of here. We all did pretty well this trip. Uh, I came in right around a penny weight. I believe everybody else did the same. I had to leave somewhat early, so um, I got a little bit less gold than everybody, but still pretty good considering a half day's worth of work on the South Yuba. We are upriver from Adam's spot. And I'm just finally turning on the camera. It's one of those days. We don't have very much light because it's November. It's cold, very cold. You can see I'm in a jacket. Everybody's in sweatshirts and jackets. It's freaking frigid out here. We are gonna get some gold either way though. I got my wetsuit and I don't know if I'm gonna put it on yet. I haven't figured that out, but I've been collecting a bunch of material. I'll show you. So this, this bucket is hours worth of work, believe it or not. It's all some really prime material from in here and some of these really small cracks. Um, it was a lot of work to get, but since, you know, it's so cold, I don't want to be bouncing in and out of the water, being cold and wet. So I'm trying to get as much material stacked up so that I could all run it in the sluice at one time. This spot's known for the good flower gold, so hopefully we run into some. Got Bert down here, Todd. It's camera time, everybody's got the cameras out. Getting gold? Love it. Nice. You have to keep me going. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. Woo! That's good. Alright, we got the sluice all set up over here. Time to run some material. Todd's over there hooting and hollering. He's got something good. Right there. Nice. I, I had another one too, but it wasn't a picker. Yeah. But that's picker BD right there. Picker BD. 
VG. VG. Visible gold. Visible gold. Yeah. Yeah, I can feel the weight. Zena's doing crevicing today, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Nice one. Picker VG. Heck yeah. Yeah. I was like, what is that? <laughs> I miss that. It's my new lucky charm, see? Yeah, there you go. You're going to put it in my new yeah. tattoo. There you go. That's how you get it. What you ought to do <laughs> is uh, just uh, get you some... Uh, right there. Uh, and loose. Get oh, some wow. quick cement and just cement it on there. Oh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Let's get some Gorilla Glue. Yeah. The clear. Yeah. <laughs> go, go into a bar and pick up women like that. Yeah. Cool. It's right here. Wow. I found one like that kind of on a, on a piece of root. Awesome. That's cool. How big is it though? Poker? Yeah, ooh. Okay. That's like the one in the middle of your uh, of your sluice right now. Yeah. Ugh. Where's that? Oh uh -oh. shit. Ah. <laughs> it disappeared. It's a Copperfield gold. Uh -oh. No, it's in there somewhere. There yeah, it is. <laughs> yeah. There she be. I don't want to lose my BG. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there you go. Yeah, it's not picker. It's not? You're holding yeah, it? It's a picker poker. Yeah, it's a poker. It's, it's very got, it's got that some... one's very thin. But yeah. I can feel it hit my hand. It's pretty. Yeah. Here, see if it'll clean. <laughs> no. no. <laughs> <laughs> it's not that big, but that was cool. I just scraped that and it was sitting right there. I was so you like, got two nice pieces right there. Three. Three? One out of here, too. Really? Yeah. Why are you pointing at your butt? <laughs> you got one out of there too. <laughs> You've been eating it? You've been eating it? Probably a really good bigger in there. Could do some nuggets in there. <laughs> Sluice number two. Pretty decent. Buckled up. Yeah, go. See what it looks like next year, huh? Yeah. I'm sure this is the last time here. Let's see, man. It seems like it. section of the South Yuba has been like a second home to us this year. We're truly blessed to have such a rich area to share with a select few. We've all done considerably well here, with much more gold still lurking around each and every nook and cranny, and with the winter rain comes the floods and new gold deposits giving us something to look forward to next season. have Mark. How you doing? This is the looker, the seer, gold seer, and you got Mr. VG. Mr. VG <laughs> Mr. right here. VG. Guilty. Guilty. I'm <laughs> gonna get some cold gold today. Yep. Get up this uh, spot. A lot of you will recognize. I'm not gonna say any names, but <laughs> I know a lot of you will recognize it. Yeah, it looks pretty today. The fall colors and the best. Not even cold. We're gonna go check Mark. out some 
cabin sites. Uh, a cabin site? Or? the hood of that car. Huh. Looks like a Volkswagen. Oh wow. Big old oh, trash cans. dump. Lemon juice. <laughs> old. Yeah. yeah. Punch top. Damn. So warm. <laughs> a lot of days down here. Yeah. <laughs> old cabin site. This is the old moonshine right here. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Who's taking a swig? <laughs> oh. yeah, I can't read it. It's probably some kind of potted meat can. Okay, well, I'm all set up. See, top cats down there are getting sprinkled on, but it's not a big deal. I'm in a rain suit. I actually have a raincoat on, and my bottom is. Um, I got a wetsuit, a thin wetsuit underneath that, like from the legs down, kind of wearing it like pants. Um, and it's perfect. I'm comfortable. I'm actually dry, a little wet on my feet, but it's warm. Uh, and we're going to start digging. It took me a little bit to get the sluice set up. It's kind of uh, funky because it's high water. But I brought the little stand that I modified for my high banker. I was able to get it set up pretty decent. Pretty good. That was pretty cool. Sitting here having a little brunch. Got me some straight up brie. Look at that. Brie and crackers. All dirty, but hey, that's how you do it out here. Right after Thanksgiving, some of the hors d'oeuvres, leftovers. <laughs> Eating brie and watching kayakers and getting gold. It's a good Saturday. Cleanup, I think this is my I don't know, second or third. I haven't been doing very well. I did one half a bucket of moss and crevicing, didn't find much, but let's see what's in this bucket. You can see, I'm all done, got everything out. Sure, but 
not what I thought was going to be here. Hopefully it all adds up in the end. I think it might. I, if I have to guess, I'm going to say should have about a half a gram and all said and done. That cold, dark, rainy day ended up turning into an amazingly beautiful day. The gold that we got that day wasn't bad either. A little bit of the gold on the top of this pan was from another trip, but the bottom was all from this particular trip. Mark, you got a cool claim. How far down do you see? All the way to that the top gravel. Top huh? All the way to the top of the You guys are gonna keep going? No, fuck no. Okay. I'm stopping right here. I'm hitting right here. That's because if you look Where are you guys going? I'm gonna play right here for it's crew now at least because look at all these big rocks are dropping out and then you just got all this shit. Everybody's okay with that, right? Huh? Yeah, I'm fine with whatever. I just you know I just think about it because I at first when I first got here, I'm gonna be honest, he told me he's like, yeah, it's fine, you can big, I get half I look at him and I was like, really? Like I was like I was like told him, I was like, I'm averaging like twelve dollars a day, bro. Sluice box. I spy with my little eye a sluice box. Man, you might want to move it for him. You might want to move it because that's why I get swept away. I will, I will, I will move it. I forgot all about that. Hey, Mark! Check out, I forgot about my friend's sluice box. We, we put this here the last time we were here. There you go. I totally forgot about that. He ran a bunch of material through it and didn't find anything. <laughs> <laughs> these guys a lot of patience <laughs> all right check it out chef Todd chef Todd on the river Todd on the river finally got the fire working properly I'll take a bite oh man that's good with Montreal oh, man. pepper <laughs> grinder and garlic salt. Mm. That's a pick me up. Heck yeah.
We had that. Getting more stew on the river wasn't that bad either, dude. Oh, that was oh. pretty freaking good. It's so easy, too. Mm -hmm. mm. Hell yeah. Hey. JC! Come get one! Got JC over here. See what he's up to. <laughs> yeah. It happens in your life. Gotta have something for the video. Yeah. Everybody's like, oh yeah. Oh yeah, a little chunk. Nice, dude. Big old piece of lead. Oh, that's a grape. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's Not a grape. Bad. Nice little poker choker. Biggest piece I got all day. Nice. Thickest. Right at the last pan. I can pick it up, so. Bigger. Oh well, I'm the biggest finger now, but yeah. It's a large poker. Small right. picker. It's a smoker. Yeah. <laughs> right there in that middle neutral zone. It's yeah. a smoker. I found it right. Oh wow, look at that pan. It's a smicker. <laughs> oh look at this actual pan though, like not bad. Wow, that's not bad at all. Dude, I found that right in front of my other hole. <laughs> On the other in front of that rock. Really? <laughs> well, Always yeah. at the end of the day. Got the magic touch again. Yep. The wine did it again. <laughs> fun, fun, fun. Goodbye, Eli Quinn. Sure was cool of Eli to let us come check out his claim and do some prospecting. We did find some gold, not as much as we hoped to, but we did definitely leave with a little bit of gold. I think I got about a half gram that day. Had an awesome lunch that Todd put together. You know, it was a great outing. <laughs>